Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Chloe, and today we're gonna to be doing a hair review for my company. Okay, we're going to do a hair review for Belle Shibe by Chloe. Say it with me Belle Shibe by Chloe. For those of you who don't know me, I own a small business called Belle Shibe by chloe and they specialize in custom made wigs 360 lace wigs full lace wigs anything wigs except for synthetic wigs we also sell bundles and hair accessories okay okay i have been doing hair reviews for all other companies now it's time to show you what my hair could do okay because my hair is than all the hairs that i've been reviewing let's get that right using my beach wave slash water wave well Beach, same thing. It's it's actually it's water wave hair, but I name it beach wave hair. So it's the same as it's the same thing. I use three bundles of 18 inch and an 18 inch closure to make this wig. The main purpose of this video is for me to show y'all that my hair is 100% virgin hair. Okay, my hair is quality. It's not quality. It's quality. Say it with me. Quality. So I'm going to show you how I flat iron the hair how I curl the hair and how I revert the hair to its original texture. This is her. Isn't she pretty? I know. Thank you. <laughs> oh, we don't mind. We don't mind me. Yeah, this is the wig. As you can see, the texture is beach wave texture. You could purchase the individual bundles on my website or you could get a wig made. You could buy the bundles and do a sewing. You could buy the bundles to do a ponytail. You could buy the bundles and make your own wig because I know some people, some people have their own wig, you know, wig, wig, personal wig maker. All I did was spray the hair with water and conditioner and use my Denman brush and the curls popping. My hair is in cornrows. That's typically how my hair looks under my wigs never before used i am the only person who's wearing it right now for the purpose of this video if you haven't watched my last video go watch my last video these glasses are from voguemeat.com you can use my discount code chloe to save money on your order okay so the first thing i'm going to do is put on a wig cap okay it's brand new like so I use a stocking cap for sanitary purposes because if I'm going to be selling the wig or if a client purchases a wig from me and I'm trying the wig on to show you what the wig looks like on, a, on an actual human, for sanitary purposes, I always wear a stocking cap, okay? Look at her. Yes, Pooh, look at her. She is giving. She's giving me curls. She's giving me body. She's giving me luster. She's giving me shine. She's giving me waves like do you feel that do you feel that i'm seasick <laughs> she's giving me seasickness okay wavy up in this all my wigs come with my clothes wig collection tag also comes with an adjustable strap you could tighten or loosen as you please so what i usually do is i put the elastic band on first make sure it fits snug and then i just put the wig down like so and then I would take the back, which is where the comb is, and just clip it in. For the wig from me, you could request that I cut the lace for you. If I cut the lace for you, you get your wig, literally just take it out of the bag, pop it on your head, and go about your business. Oh, wow. Wow. That's really nice, y'all. Honestly, wow. I'm going to cut the lace on camera. You don't cut straight across. I like to like do like a zigzag kind of motion. <laughs> With a good flat iron and some patience, you can get it bone straight. Something to keep in mind, if you're in a hotter climate such as St. Lucia or one of the Caribbean islands, you can get it bone straight, but I, I cannot guarantee that it will stay bone straight because of the climate. It basically affects the curl, you understand? If you have naturally curly hair and you straighten your hair and you go outside in the heat, you know what I'm talking about. I'm going to be using my eap heat flat iron my favorite flat iron ever if you have not seen my video i did a review on this flat iron i paid for it with my own money so i'm gonna be using my product of a goddess argan oil which is almost done and i'm gonna do the, do the comb chase method <laughs> So 
talk about the elephant in the room and what's been going on in the media. Black people fighting for their rights, fighting for equality, fighting for freedom, fighting for justice. Honestly, my opinion on all of this is I wish I could go like downtown and join the protest. I really want to, like, I, but I don't really have anybody to go with. I have a little friend. If I tell him if he's going, then let me know and I'll go with him. And he's a young black man with dreadlocks, okay? And you know the stigma I don't want, you know, for us to go down there and because they see him, he's black and he have locks, they target him. And if they do anything to him, there'll be a problem. I'll probably end up going down with him because I would not let that happen, okay? It's real out there. It's not a game, it's not a joke. It's real life and people are literally dying. Like I feel like all of this, everything that's going on right now, this is like literally history in the making. Like 10, 20, 50 years from now, that is going to be in the black history books. And I want to be able to say that I was a part of it. Like, you know, I witnessed it firsthand. Like I was there protesting against the injustice and the racism that's going on in America. Not just America, it happens all over, but America is a whole different breed. And represent my Caribbean people as well because we like to put ourselves on the side from everybody else. Yes, we're from the Caribbean, we're from the Caribbean, we're from the islands, no, but we're still black. No matter if you light black, medium black, dark black, you're still black, okay? No matter if you shabbing, you're still black. And we need to protect our black men because I need to find me a black husband so I can have some nice black babies. I, I want me a chocolate husband, okay? I want me a chocolate husband, dark chocolate preferably, some caramel chocolate swirl babies. Do your part, do what you can. I don't really want to talk about that too much because I feel like it kind of gets me emotional. Like I was literally watching the video last night and I was crying, like literally crying, like real tears, big tears out of my eyes. The video of the black couple from Atlanta, like they, they just stopped them. They pulled the girl out of the car, they measurably nobody. You could clearly see the car in the front has a white couple and the white woman well there waving at the camera, smiling, waving like they they completely ignored the white couple in the car in the front and they targeted the black couple in the car in the back. And they both were out past curfew. They both were in the cars. They both were couples. One was a black couple, one was a white couple. So why did y'all target the black couple? I don't understand. And y'all not even Slowing them down to knock on the door and say, you know, can y'all please put your window down and talk to them. Y'all are banging on the people's car door, breaking the glass, just pulling the door open like while people drive like that. Not, that not, like, that's not right. We're all human at the end of the day. We all breathe the same air. We all have the same blood. We, are, we basically the same. The only thing that makes us different is a couple little like physical features but on the inside we all are the same so i don't understand why why is it such a big thing like because we have a darker skin tone for to be treated differently anyways that give me a wash that give me a whole wash i don't talk about it again we are almost at 1k y'all i'm so excited it might be small to most people because they're like oh that's 1000 followers that's nothing 1000 people a whole 1000 if you had $1,000 that's a lot of money it's a lot if that's the case then if I had $1,000 and I say look that means you shouldn't take it because that's not a lot of, that's, that, that's not a lot to you but to me 1000 is a lot even if it's $1,000 1000 followers 1000 wigs my ultimate goal honestly is is to hit 100k and it might sound like a lot but I know I can do it and I know I will do it. Even if it takes me four years to do it, I will do it. I need a name, like, I need a name. What should I call you all, like? Like, you know how Aaliyah J calls her girls Aaliyah Army? I need a name to call my, my supporters. Like, on my business page, I call my I call my girls my Bell Babes because my business is Bell. She be by Chloe. Chloe's cuties. Chloeanians. I want to. I don't want to call you all my fans. I don't want to call you all. You know. I want to call you all something else. Thanks for all the support that I have gotten thus far. I want to do a one k giveaway. Um, I'm trying to figure out what I should put in the box. If you know it, fat. Watch it from the back. Show part that. This is quite lovely, yeah. This is quite lovely. Wow. So my ultimate goal is to find me a logo that I love and stick with it for the rest of my life because 
I'm ready to take my business to the next level and I can't do that if I don't have a logo that represents me, my personality and my business. Okay. So I found a girl who does really nice logos and her prices are reasonable. She's a little more on the expensive side but it's worth it because I have seen her work and her work is... See the thing with me, the kind of person I am, if there is something that I want, I do not mind spending the money on it as long as I know it's going to be worth my money. I believe cheaper isn't always better. I'd rather take my money and spend it on quality than buy something cheap and then in the end I'm disappointed. I should have just saved my money and gone with like somebody who's like real professional professional. Yep, I have, I probably own like five flat irons. Oh look, I keep putting my hand, why do you put my hand? One is chi or chai, whatever they call it, which is a very um big brand or expensive company known well known for their hair products and hair um tools but the chai does not compare to the eap heat honey the eap heat brings the heat come here and visit my world, world, world. My fingers pass right through it. We pass through. AliExpress could never, okay? After nine o'clock, she can't come in. After me, I eat that. Is that an ice cream truck? It is! It is! It is! Where is it? <gasps> ice cream truck! Oh, wait, that's ice cream truck? What the hell? Why it looks so ghetto? I'm gonna get out of ice cream truck. <laughs> it's a plain white van. No ice cream sign written on it, nothing. I would not dance like a whole pedophile vehicle. <laughs> like, you know that vans that they kidnap children in? It's a plain white dirty van. It's so dirty looking brown. So I'm done. I flat ironed my hair. What do you think? Let me know. Do you like it or do you love it? This video is a long chat. Ooh, look at the quality though. So now I'm going to go ahead and curl the hair using my handy dandy <laughs> curling wand. <laughs> curling wand. It's like, I wouldn't go ahead and curl my hair using the curling wand. I don't have an actual curling iron and these give me curling iron kind of curls so I'm gonna use that. Come here and visit my I've taken my time and done some like really small wand curls but <laughs> this is tired. I've been sitting here for like three hours. Flat ironing and you know kind of thing. So I'm gonna just pass my fingers through it. So you see it can take the curls, it's just that that curling iron is bigger so the curls come out fatter. Come here and visit. Now I'm going to revert the curls back. So I'm going to just spray my hair with some water and a little bit of conditioner and watch magic happen let me repeat it up already the life starter didn't check me i mean magic magic okay so, so just spray water and just spray generously come here and visit my world the denman brush mine has been a word mess because it's, it's been a long time since i've had it but you could just use your denman brush and then just start brushing the hair through to make sure all the water is like completely saturated take the hair like so and scrunch it up like that just like that see it's already coming back nicely <laughs> Come here and, visit my world. and that's it simple as that okay so let me do the other side because i gotta go <laughs> i miss not the life half the life there you need to go and get some tips and all the time your boyfriend from the guys because the guys are talking tonight makela look makela messaging me she really won't ask me why not in the live <laughs> Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to let this air dry and I'm going to go watch my live. By the time the live is done, my hair should be dry. The curls are back.
Like they never left poop. Y'all, I almost go on sleep and forget to end the video. What time is it now? It's like what? Two o'clock in the morning. <laughs> the lab ended around 12 or something, but I was on the phone. It's dried. And as y'all can see, the curls reverted right back. Very nice. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe and shop Bell Shea by Chloe. Bear girl in the army. When we step in the party, I wanna up up on a yardie. Watch me dancing.